Hey guys, so obviously I'm doing a bonus Jonas today because I figure I haven't done a whole lot of my Try It or Toss It series videos because I think I took like the last two or three weeks off. Oh no. So I am featuring a very special product today. I got in my swap box and she started something that I'm afraid will never end. I'm so afraid. For today's Try It or Toss It, I'm going to talk about the Maybelline New York Lip Elixirs. Now, this is the guy that Felicia, my friend Felicia Fresh here on YouTubers, got me if my camera shall focus, maybe not so much, but it is a lip gloss. It kind of looks like a lipstick in the little tubey tube, hence why I thought it was a lipstick at first. I'm, I'm so stupid when it comes to stuff like this. I really am. I got this one. Oh my gosh, what color did I get? I got a 005 Breathtaking Apricot. I went and actually bought this guy because I was so impressed with this thing over here, which is 025 Mauve Mystique. Oh my gosh, what can I not say about these lip glosses here? One, they're very opaque. I love the colors. The color payoff is absolutely wonderful, especially for a lip gloss. The feel of the lip glosses on your face feel like a balm, so they're kind of minty. At least in my opinion, they feel kind of minty. The doe foot applicator, oh my gosh. I know I could have sworn I heard someone say that the doe foot applicator by this, you know, that's in these lip glosses are actually made out of bunny rabbits. I could be wrong, but I don't want to, I don't want to say something that I'm not completely and utterly informed on. Oh, I did it again. What is it with me and like jabbing stuff into my nose? Mm. But the smell is wonderful. I really like this gloss. Let me do some swatchy swatchies for y'all. This is the mauve color. It is actually very opaque in my opinion. It's quite pretty on the skin or on the lips. It feels wonderful. It's, I, it, it lasts a long time. I mean, for a gloss, I thought once I drank something or once I ate something, the, you know, moisturiness of a gloss would be gone, but it's still there at, for, for a very long time. I mean, surprisingly. And then this is, ooh, if I can get it out there, get it out of the tube. It's the breathtaking apricot color. It's like a pink with shimmer in it. Let me do this one right under it. It's like a peachy color. It's right on top. It is a shimmery pink. Let me show y'all. I'm just going to swatch central here because I have nothing on my lips right now. Hey, y'all can't understand me. But the color, I actually like it. It's quite easy to apply if I can stop applying while I'm talking. And uh -huh. there we go. It's actually quite pretty. I like it for my skin tone. It actually doesn't look too pink. It's not too glittery either. Even though in the packaging it looks like super duper glittery. It's not that glittery. It's not sticky. My, my, you know, it's, it doesn't, my lips don't glue to each other. Like some glosses end up doing on my face. They're not, it's not heavy. It's actually quite nice. I definitely do like these glosses and they last very, very long and they look very, very pretty, right? The only downside to these lip glosses is they are about $9 the drugstore. So if you can't get these on sale, like buy one, get one half off maybe, or where you get extra bucks at CVS or something to drop the price, I really would avoid them because you're going to fall in love with them. I, I hate to say it because Felicia, you started something. You, you definitely started something that you shouldn't have because I really, really like these lip glosses, but I really hate the price. I mean, for $9, they're not really worth that. Which, I mean, if you compare it to other glosses, I'm sure they are because they're absolutely wonderful. And if I had the money, I probably would buy every last one of them in the line, but I just can't do that. I just can't. But again, I would definitely try these products if you can afford it because once you start start buying these, you will not want to stop because I love these products so much. But yes, I absolutely do say try these. Try these if you get the chance, but obviously hit the sales. So if you can't do that, avoid it. But if you can, go out and buy them or coupon it or something because they are very expensive for what they are, but you will not regret it. You won't. 
you more than likely won't. I love them. Yes, I love them. All right, so that is today's Try It or Toss It. I want to thank y'all so much for watching, and I will see y'all next time. Bye, guys.